The Bay Area, there is a lot of hometown pride this evening for the new Democratic nominee. Kelsey Thord spoke with supporters who turned out for a DNC watch party in Oakland. Well, this is such an historic night for so many people across the country, but for Oaklanders here, this night means something even more. We're here at a watch party hosted by the NAACP Oakland branch, and we talk to people about what this historic nomination means to them. To even know someone from Oakland is going to become president of the United States, it's amazing. Cynthia Adams, the president of the NAACP Oakland branch and organizer of this watch party, says many of the people here never thought they would live to see the day where a woman, let alone a black South Asian woman and an Oakland native, would rise to become the Democratic nominee for president. We probably thought we would see a man, but a woman, an Afro-American woman before any other race, it's a blessing. Dozens of Oakland natives and people from across the Bay gathered to watch Harris's historic nomination. Sisters Ernestine and Adia Harrison told us watching her accept the nomination in the town where both they and Harris were born is something special. Being the nominee for a, the one of the two major parties is a big deal. And so just seeing Oakland represented in that kind of positive way is something that I'm excited about. Terry Wiley, the inspector general of San Francisco and former colleague of VP Harris when they were both at the Alameda County District Attorney's Office, told us he too is proud to see her rise to this moment. But he's not surprised she's here. Uh, in terms of the hard work, uh, the intelligence, uh, the integrity, and just the dignity that she always carried herself with. For Cynthia Adams, the feeling of this night can be boiled down to one word. Joy. And what does that joy mean to her? That's hope. That is hope. That is hope. I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. I can't wait. And you can really feel that hope here in this room. People are energized. They are excited. But they also know that this is going to be a lot of work for them between now and the general election. They say they are ready for that task and they are excited to see what happens in November.